Hello everybody and welcome back to another 2020 Senate prediction on the channel. Today we're going over the state of Alabama, where the most vulnerable Democrat in the country, Doug Jones, is fighting for his seat against Republican opponent, Tommy Tuberville. Jones won in the highly controversial 2017 special Senate election in the deep red state of Alabama, and pundits view his seat as the most likely Republican flip this November. But let's get right into it, starting with an average of the latest five polls conducted in Alabama from July 22nd to August 11th, 2020. Tuberville holds an 8.2 point lead with 48% of support in the average poll to Doug Jones's abysmal 39.8%, which is extremely low for an incumbent of any stature. Next is the JHK forecast, where their expected final result in the state of Alabama is Tuberville plus 10.4 points, 54.4% of the final vote going to him, as opposed to exactly 44% for Doug Jones. Next up, we have the Our Progress forecast. Tuberville holds a 9.6 point advantage in this one and wins with 43.1% to Jones's 43.5%. Finally, up comes my EP forecast, which takes a number of different data points from a wide range of sources and runs an algorithm to weight and properly average them. Tuberville leads by 12.3 points in this forecast, coming in with 55.2 points to Jones's 42.9 points. And finally, we have the data consensus, which takes all of the data you just saw and averages it out. Tommy Tuberville does lead by 10.1 points overall, with 52.7% to Doug Jones's 42.6%. And last, but certainly not least, the 2016 presidential election results in Alabama, which displayed just how much of a conservative state it is. Donald Trump won with 62.08% to Hillary Clinton's 34.36%, a near 30-point margin. And with this Senate race falling under a general election this year, the chances of a Doug Jones victory here are even slimmer because Trump is on the ballot again. That being said, the polls have now closed and we have a key race alert coming in from our EP studios. 7% of the vote is coming in out of Alabama and Republican hopeful Tommy Tuberville holds a lower than expected lead so far. Just a little over 8,000 votes separates him from Democrat Doug Jones. He leads with 51.94% to 46.14% as of right now. This is still very early but a promising sign for Democrats. As expected, with 31% of precincts reporting in the Alabama Senate race, Tommy Tuberville has extended his lead over Doug Jones to 73,000 votes and 11 points. 54.08% of the vote is in Tuberville's column to Jones's 42.85%, and he leads with 355,000 votes to Jones's 282,000 votes. We expect to make a call here very, very soon. Tommy Tuberville is the projected winner in Alabama's Senate race. The formerly successful Auburn College football coach defeated Jeff Sessions in the Republican primary and has now defeated incumbent Democrat Doug Jones. Jones will have served one shortened term as a U.S. Senator when his term ends in January, but tonight's results will have been expected for his campaign. Tuberville wins with 56.01% of the vote to Jones is 42.28%, and by a vote total of 291,000 votes. 100% of the vote is in, and Tuberville is the projected winner. And taking a look at the Alabama county map, along with the results out of the state's eight largest counties by population, Jones won in two of eight of these, Jefferson County and DeKalb County, while Tuberville is victorious in six of them, Mobile, Cobb, Clayton, Chatham, Cherokee and Forsyth counties all go to him. Again, he wins with 56% of the vote to Jones's 42.3% in this Alabama Senate prediction. But that does it for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed. Please make sure to like the video down below if you did, as well as make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Also, check out more content on my channel here. Thank you all so much for watching and tune in next time. EP out.